What's up everyone? Welcome back to Sekiro. Am I recording? Yes, I'm recording. Cool. It's time to jump into this hole again. Uh, which doesn't sound too good, but it's what we got to do. One thing I want to try out. Because I immediately got noticed. Okay, I just, I just I, I got caught off guard by this item. I immediately got noticed when I jumped down there, so I have that sugar. Yeah, suppresses sound and presence for a time. Oh, cool. Nice little animation on that. Yeah. Alright. I think this is good. It's gotta be a little bit quicker. Damn it. I was too slow. Oh, did they not notice? Oh, I'm still stealth. They might not have noticed. The question here is, do I go for drop attack on the big guy? And then take my chances taking out the little guy? Or immediately... Or go for the little guys? I don't know how difficult it would be to... How many are there? Like one, there's two. Is there only two? Seriously? Fuck it. Longar Centipede Sen Un. Something is on fire. Your ass is on fire. Yeah, he's freaking out. This is Voldo. Jesus. Damn it. Okay. Well, that's not easy. Fucking Voldo, man. He doesn't take pos posture damage either. Looks like he would be... Damn it! Oh shit. Really, I'm... Really, I'm trying to jump there. Oh, is he weak to... Shit. That wasn't actually that bad. Yellow gunpowder. Used for explosive prosthetic tool upgrades. Holy shit! And a prayer bead. That wasn't actually that difficult. I thought it was gonna be. Okay. Naisu. Black gunpowder. Black gunpowder. Nothing. Alright. Well, that was... That was not nothing. Hmm. I don't know. I, I don't know if... I'm just thinking of whether I just got lucky with this enemy. Because... I'm going to be... What the hell? Oh, there's more of them. Okay. I was wondering what was spawning me there. So yeah, because it sure as hell felt like I got lucky. But no, you know what? I'm not gonna undersell my skill. That was 100% pure talent. There's a shit ton of... There's some weird lizard things here. Oh, sorry lizard thing. And the shit ton of dogs as well. Let me try and get on top of... But you can't, can you? You gotta... Do yeah. What the hell? Gotta go doggo hunting. My bad, doggos. Man, that is satisfying. I've been dealing with Dark Souls 2 dogs with a crossbow, so... Uh, 
You'll have to excuse my enthusiasm for killing them. Just how it is, you know. So, I don't remember. Uh, I think I went this way. But there are dudes here now. Blind as hell dudes. Seriously. These guys are very unaware. Hey, you missed me. You made me miss out on the critical hit. That's what you get. Doesn't help though that we have a fairly difficult section to deal with. Those. I don't know what exactly they're called. Those weird knights. With the twin blades. Oh, hello. Hello, hello. How do you like being backstabbed? Oh, hello. Okay, and that... You know when something just feels like a glitch? That was that. Although I did just fuck up by taking too long. Man, that projectile is wild. How the hell are you lacking half your HP? Did you explode yourself? It's not very smart. Alright, we gotta have the loaded axe. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Jesus, that dot. You know what? Let's... Okay. Still works. I was about to say, damn, does that not work? But it works. Can I seriously not get up here? Come on, game. You gotta work with me here. That guy chin sugar might come in handy later as well. Kind of feel bad for these dudes almost. Doesn't feel like they stand in too much of a chance if I'm gonna be honest okay thank you game oh I can do this I couldn't do it. I don't know why. So how wild is this Gaichin Sugar? Let me just test it. Uh, or Gachijin or whatever. Don't worry, if I mispronounce something, you'll have to give me a break. Okay, it's wild. It's really wild. Don't worry, just a ghost. Never mind. Just a ghost. Come a little bit closer, please. Yes, turn around. Nothing to see here. There's three of them. Fuck, why did I only think there was two? Okay, are we in trouble? We are in big trouble, boys. Unless... They cannot come in here. Which might very well be a possibility. Okay. I think we are nice and safe here. Lump of fat wax. Let's check out this temple area. 
because it seems wild. Yeah, the for people who haven't played the game, one thing you gotta get used to is that the jumping has like this weird homing aspect to it. Okay. Yeah, I did not mean to do that. Oh, hello. In fact, I can correct my mistake. Reset. Reset time. Good thing you can just do that. Okay, that's not dead. I thought it was dead. Like I said previously, there's no way these things like fire. And it seems I am correct. Shit. Oh, and it heals itself. What a dick. You know what? Just because of that. Fuck. I'm, I got arrogant. It's okay. It's nearly posture broken. It can... Heal all the HP at once. It's not gonna matter. That took more resources than it should have. I'm a, I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't know who is like noticing me here. Should I Gaijin sugar it up? <laughs> Gaijin sugar. Yeah, it's a guy. It's for Gaijins only. People who suck at this game. I have 12 of them, so... Why not? People are always telling me to go farm as well sometimes. Oh yeah, this is... Hella better. Crisis stealth mode, you know. Isn't it weird, you know? Just like, I was thinking about this, like, how little impact, like, overall impact, crisis. Okay, they, okay, yeah, yeah, I got your message, they get back up. But how, though? They cannot be killed. Dragon's Blood Droplet. Nice. So that was just a waste of resources then. Because these fools... They don't give a shit. But where do we go from here? Uh, bundle jeans. Oh, this is the... Restores your resurrective thingy. Yeah, where the hell do we go from here? Is there like some second level to this? Don't tell me you gotta go out again. Uh, yeah, let's just stay cool. Cool car. Oh, we gotta go this way. Shit. This really the only way? I'm guessing. Alright then, I got your message game. At least you gave me a checkpoint. The checkpoint seems to be seem to be fairly infrequent in this area, unlike you know, uh, previously like Ashina Castle, they were like surprisingly frequent. I was gonna com comment on it too, like how frequently there are checkpoints. But it turns out maybe that's not for all areas. Man, getting HP back from <laughs> critical attacks is the most useful skill. This feels like a boss arena. Like, I don't know about you guys, but what a Voldo. 
Oh, you can backstab these little bitch ass Waldos like this. Not even backstab, critical. Yeah, I don't like caves. Have I ever told you that? Like, these... We've been here. You can see like these cave diving videos of, that people do. Oh, you take damage. Those freak me out. And which is weird because I'm not like claustrophobic. Claustrophobic, I can't even say it. But that's different. Like squeezing through a tight like cave little tunnel. Yeah, that's... That ain't for the boy. Ain't about that life. Okay. It's a dude. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was worried that that was it. And I was like, damn. Damn, damn, damn. That would have been... Muy shitty, as they say in Spanish. Hello, lizards. I almost... Did you see what I almost... Whoa, don't skate off the edge. I saw grapple. Okay, so you can swing back. The question is, why would you want to? Where could this possibly lead? This is going to be some key item, I can already tell. Senpu Esoteric Text. A book of secrets that grants the ability to learn Senpu-style skills. Those of the Senpu Temple mastered martial arts in the pursuit of virtue. However, Senpu was seized by an obsession for the undying which corrupted their teaching and style. This is it? Nah, there's gotta be something more. Senpu esoteric text. There's a reason they're letting you swing back here. And letting me nearly fall off. Okay, so there must be something we gotta do here, in here. Cause I seem to remember there being another route, 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 whatever. Maybe it's just the other side of it. Leads out, of course it is. Of course it's not. Damn, I really don't want to be lost in this game. It sucks to be lost in a Souls game. Not something that happens too often, I'm going to be honest with you, but... You know what, let's rest. Hmm, hmm, hmm. In. The. Resting. I didn't see, like, any other possible... What is this rest place called? Oops, wrong. This is I'm starting to mess up the buttons. The main hall. Because, yeah, the main hall implies... Whoa, whoa, okay. Obvious. Too obvious. Right in the center. It's a little... Whatever. It's a little tchotchke. Oh, it's a bell. He just knows what to do. That's kind of terrifying, that statue. I'm not going to be... I'm not going to beat around the bush. It reminds me of that Tomb Raider scene, you know, from the old Tomb Raider. The film. Where the statue comes to life. That movie is so stupid. Okay. Hunter's Dream. A very convenient method of teleportation. What the hell is this place? Oh, it's the three monkeys, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
the one that cannot hear. Oh shit! It's a straight up, it's a straight up chimp. It just fucked off. Lucif Hall Bell, a five crown bell made of aged bronze. When wrong, monkeys and wolves alike are returned to their initial state. However, a monkey caught in the phonic screen will not escape whether the bell is wrong or not. What? We have a boss fight as well? Folding screen monkeys. Uh, this I don't get. Oh, there's one up there. Do you gotta sneak up to them? Is that what this is? We haven't had like a stealth boss fight. Oh. Well that monkey took the hell off. They left it little, this little vape smoke here. Okay. It's a puzzle, isn't it? It is a puzzle, I think. Below is an abyss. The bottom cannot be seen. Above is darkness. Nothing can be seen. Get all philosophical on me. Can't even talk. All right. I'm assuming these are hints. A bare flame in the wind. When it goes out, the place becomes dark as night. We can open that. Okay. What if it attracts one of the monkeys? He's gonna come in here to light up the flame again. Or something. Maybe we gotta close it too. We can close it. My puzzle senses are tingling though. Oh shit. I'm gonna be made to look like an idiot in this boss fight. I can already tell. Okay, so one of the monkeys cannot hear. There's one right there. But it's I'm not gonna be able to drop attack it because shit. Oh, I just straight up killed one of them. Man, this is f this game is fucked up. <laughs> like, he's just straight up murdering animals half the time. Dogs, monkeys. No one is safe from Sekiro. There's a bell there. Uh, don't know what it did. It even did anything. So we got one third of it, haven't we? Basically. This fight. We can swing across. Oh shit, is it? It's here somewhere. What the? It's a ghost monkey. So you gotta do something with the bell. 
It looks like something happened. There was a monkey there. The bell is deafening. Ring it recklessly. Will oh, that's how you kill the... That's the one that is blind. Is it? Oh, it's going in there. I thought it was spawning back. Yes. Come on, lock onto it. Sekiro, what the fuck? Okay, we got two. I don't know this. <laughs> don't worry. Like, this is not... I've not, like, figured out the grand trick here. Okay. And maybe we fuck off. Because something happened. God damn it. The ghost chimp again. Uh, I don't know. One thing I'm a little bit worried about is that there are clearly supposed to be four of them. This room we haven't been to. Not yet. Okay. You know what? Let's have a look around the whole area. Because I haven't done that yet. Yeah, you can come up. Shit. Oh. Where did you come from, Mr. Monkey? Okay. And there's supposed to be one more. Which... What did this say? There is, there's something about the bell. Oh, oh they... That's fucked up. We killed all the monkeys. What the hell? It's a dude. Oh, is he the hint if you're too stupid? Yes, <laughs> yes. I'm happy about that. We got all of them. Yeah. Yeah, this is this that must be like a timer. Yeah, it's like yeah, you're too stupid, here's the hint. How did did I get this much? Oh, I got him with the opening the door. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I think I got all of these. Oh, it is near Nirvana. That's kind of funny. So these guys haven't actually reached Nirvana or this guy. He's just... Fourth monkey? I don't know. He wasn't smart like me. That's the difference. 
cool. This last one, we gotta figure this shit out. All them bitches are dead. But I have a feeling. And I'm a little bit worried that this isn't gonna, like, reset the entire thing. Uh, where is it? Elusive Hall Bell. Okay. Um... Shit, I don't... <laughs> okay, well, this is embarrassing. I am looking like kind of an idiot. Where is the stupid fourth mo Whoa, there's a monkey. But these monkeys, killing these monkeys doesn't do anything to the total HP of the situation. I just kind of feel like an asshole for doing it. This is the place I've not like been to yet. I haven't like spider man my way through here. What you can't? You can't spider man your way through. Fuck. I thought you could. Fourth monkey. But there isn't supposed to be one. Right? Because it's always the one that can't hear, the one that the one that can't smell, maybe. But how? How'd that even work? The noise of the roaring waterfall is def oh okay. That's how I got the Well, I got one of them. I I don't get this. Google help me out. I got to look it up. I got to All right, there will be an edit here. Okay, so I think we got to do this again. Thank you, Google. It didn't take long for it to come up, which is kind of a hint that I'm not the only one who had trouble with this. Apparently, you run here. Cut a left. Cut a right. And if you come up here, there should be like some golden footsteps. And there he is. We just slaughtered a bunch of animals. Okay, so it follows you. Well, I had to look it up. Kind of shitty. I could have ran around like an idiot there, but... The thing is, we gotta keep the episode rolling along, you know. Sorry, Monkos. But maybe they're not dead after all, because this is kind of like a ghost world, isn't it? We just plastered them back on the little paper. We got a robot arm anyways, so, you know, it's like, who can even contend with us? I'm really like curious as to where this is going. Oh shit. That looks nice. Looks better than the other place, the previous one. If I'm gonna be honest with you. Oh shit, that's a lot of experience. The folding screen monkeys guarded the Hall of Illusions and befriended the divine child of rejuvenation. There's another kid. Puppeteer ninjutsu. Manipulates the victim like a puppet. Activate after backstab. 
Forces one who should have fled this realm to remain. Ooh. Like, what's it called? Undead report, but actually useful, maybe. Yeah, there's another kid. It's like Kuro. But first, what do I do but explore? Hmm, maybe not. Let's let's move the plot along just a little bit. She exactly looks like Kuro as well. Or that's a she, yeah. I still try I still almost call Kuro a she every time. But we can't die, can we? Ooh, shit. New katana. This is some weep shit. Uh oh, we died. We gotta do something first, don't we? Oh, she doesn't know? Shit, I thought we had to do something else before it. Damn. An Odachi capable of slaying the undying. Its crimson blade will take the life of any who dares draw it. Without the power of resurrection, one could not hope to wield this weapon which allows one to defeat even infested beings. Okay. Gracious gift of tears. Oh, now she knows. Now she's up to date. Nice paintings there. I'm trying to listen to the plot. Okay, Dark Souls 2, Emerald Herald. Cool. Are we friends now? Rice. Oh, where was she? There was a. Yeah, there was someone who wanted rice. Gradually recovers vitality for a time. Even in falsehood, the power of the dragon's blood brings bountiful harvest. Okay. Okay, we can go and... Oh, 
All right, we got some rice. Welcome to the rice fields. So do we get to use this badass sword now? Oh no, he still uses his dinky ass sword. Which is a little bit strange. Because why would you not want to use the badass sword? But hey, who am I to criticize anyone? Oh, that's how it... Yep, that's how it ties together. Okay. You little bitch. So how do I use this mortal blade? The moron blade. Does it just like is it does it just like finish enemies off with this? Damn it. I swear I jumped. It's such a DSP thing to say. This is not good. I thought you could break these pots. I want to test this thing out. Fuck. The jump doesn't work. What? But he didn't use it, did he? Hold on. There's, there's no way to switch weapons, is there? What the fuck? All right. I don't get it. I'm gonna go and rest here. So, with that, there's a lot to process. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this episode of Sekiro. Uh, yeah, you, you can't switch weapons, obviously. So, what it do? What if I get a backstab? Is that different? Well, he doesn't use it. Oh! Damn. Cool. I got it. I got it. That's all I wanted to know. I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this episode here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Sekiro. Thanks for watching again. And I'll see all of you next time. Goodbye.